Mmm, oishi! Okay, here I am in Shibuya. I am looking for the famous lamb shabu shabu Hitsujino Yu restaurant. Okay, now I'm kind of lost, but luckily I have the Halal Gourmet Japan website which can help me, guide me to get to where I want because there's a map there and there's so much more other information. Okay, so let me check. Aha, uh -huh, we're going that way. After walking about 10 minutes from Shibuya Station, you will reach this restaurant, Hitsujino you okay you look for this big bright yellow signboard okay remember it now guys in their menu they only have one halal lamb shabu shabu it is the only halal menu in here so vegetables lamb meatballs rice and their sauce so it's a big set you'll be full and people come here to look for it so don't worry All right, here we have everything on the table. And this here, what we have is the base water that is boiling, is fish and seaweed base. And over here is a, a wide number of vegetables. And over here, we have the lamb shabu shabu. And here is lamb meatball. Now this one is interesting how to cook it. I'll show you later. And we have our halal certified yuzu konzu. And this, the sambal. And rice, of course. Okay, now the first we are going to cook is the lamb meatballs. Now, interesting, the lamb meatballs, how you cook it is you take your desired amount and you put it down and you push it into the water. There you go. Okay, take some vegetables. Alright, it's time to shab shab. Take your lamb. Oh, okay. Okay, you take your lamb and you go shab. And one more shab. There you go, see? Until you see the color change, it's slightly brown, then you pick it up. I mean, if you want to have it raw, it's up to you. Mmm, oishi! Mm. Amazing. I, I love lamb and the taste of lamb is perfect. It's not very strong that it, it gives you that bad taste. It's just perfect light, melts, soft, lamb tender. Amazing. Okay, now if you can see here, look here, the lamb meatballs are ready. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to dip it in this sambal. Okay, and then we're going to dip it in the sauce. And here we go. Oh. First impression, so hot. But it tastes great. The lamb is tasty. It's very soft, tender. The taste, the texture, it just melts in your mouth. The flavors, I'm sure there are more flavors inside this lamb, this blend. But I don't know what it is. But I think there's black pepper and some other stuff but it tastes perfectly good. Okay, the way to eat your vegetables while having this is not to eat it first, to leave it last. And the vegetables will pick up the flavors from the lamb which you uh, cooked inside just now. Okay, now let's try this. Looks super hot. But for the sake of food for you guys, I'm doing this. This tastes good. The vegetables has a tiny tint taste of lamb. From the lamb that we cook, the flavors from it gives it that extra kick that you wouldn't have as vegetables if you eat it just like that. Amazing experience. So remember that. You leave your vegetables inside, okay? Great, so overall, you know, it was a fun experience with the Shabu Shabu. I would like to tell you to come here to experience the Shabu Shabu. You wouldn't have this experience anywhere. And the meatballs are great, I tell you. The mixture of the shabu shabu, the lamb and the vegetables infused with lamb water flavors is perfect.